multiplying a number by 10. Before watching this video, I advise you to watch the video about the tens and the hundreds by clicking here. It will help you to understand this lesson. Let's start multiplying 3 by 10. To multiply 3 by 10, we should repeat number 10 3 times. So it's 10 plus 10 plus 10 equals 30. So it is 3 tens. So 3 times 10 equals 3 tens. To multiply 5 by 10, we should repeat number 10 5 times. So we have 5 tens. 5 times 10 equals 50. Now 10 times 10. 10 times 10 is 10 tens, which is equal to 100. Multiplying 13 by 10. 13 times 10 is 13 tens, so it is 10 tens plus 3 tens. So it is 100 plus 30, which is equal to 130. So 13 times 10 equals 130. Another example, 29 times 10. 29 times 10 is 29 tens. So it's 20 tens plus 9 tens. And as we know that 20 tens equals 200 and 9 tens equals 90. So 29 times 10 equals 290. Now observe these equalities. 3 times 10 equals 30. 5 times 10 equals 50. 10 times 10 equals 100. 13 times 10 equals 130 and 29 times 10 equals 290. So, what do you notice? We notice that each time we multiply a number by 10, we rewrite the number, then we put the zero to the right side of this number. So, we should study that to multiply a number by 10, just put the zero to the right of the digits of this number. Let's take another example, 14 times 10. To multiply 14 by 10, just write 14, then put the zero to the right of 14. 14 times 10 equals 140. Now multiply 37 by 10. So just write 37, then put zero to the right side of this number. 37 times 10 equals 370. To multiply 42 by 10, just write 42, then put 0 to the right of 42. 42 times 10 equals 420. 